Welcome to Easy Fix. In the previous two videos, we have learned about ignition key, ammeter, then ignition coil, contact breaker, and battery. In the second video, we have learned about alternator, rectifier, 12 volt AC regulator, and the connection which is for headlamp. And the link is given in the description. Again, we will start with the basic diagram. So, on the positive, and get connected to a meter from the ammeter again it reaches key from here it get connected to ry and these two are connected the color is red yellow so this is our the basic connection so now we are going for the remaining connections which are switch control then pilot lamp indicator horn then brake light in the green joint we are having a red white wire which is taken from this red yellow joint and which reaches this green 4 pin joint and here the color is red white then it moves through this and reaches this switch assembly so inside this switch so this is what the red white wire so if I move the switch to pilot lamp position so here the speedometer backlight ammeter backlight and tail lamp get enabled so here the connection so here it's red white which is connected to this one okay so this one is used to enable the back light as well as tail lamp okay so here the color is ash likewise here we are having an ash black so which is used to enable the pilot lamp here it get connected to red white to the switch from the switch first i am taking ash black color so this ash black reaches this joint so here it's black 4 so from here it reaches black 4 ash black from here it reaches a junction and return back you can see this ash black wire here we will connect this pilot lamp so, and the uh, black is connected to the ground we will have two pilot lamp therefore we are having two socket from this black junction here again it come and connected to the pilot lamp so ash black so likewise here we are having another one wire ash wire so here also which reaches this black join so from this switch it reaches 
black for joint and here the color is ash from here it reaches a joint which is present inside this wire sleeve okay so from here we will have connections which is for used to connect the backlight of the speedometer as well as a meter okay so here the color is ash so from here this is what the speedometer backlight connection here we are having this ash wire likewise this one is red one is for a meter connection so here also we are having ash okay these two are for back light again from this junction this line move through the wire sleeve and reaches this white junction so here we are having white five junction okay so from this it reaches the back end and which is used to trigger the tail lamp okay so here in this part the tail lamp get connected therefore when we make the switch to pilot lamp position here the speedometer backlight a meter backlight and tail lamp get enabled then for indicator red white which is taken from this red yellow junction and reaches this white to join and here we will connect this flasher the flasher is nothing but it act like a switch which on and off over a interval normally we will connect a buzzer in parallel therefore due to this on and off we will get some sound flasher so from here we are having an output white color so here white and here the color is red white so this white colors move through this wire sleeve and reaches this black joint So here the color is white color so from here again it reaches the switch okay so inside the switch here the white color is connected to this key so here which is used to turn left and right so if you go for right turn here which will be connected to this green wire and if you go for left turn that white connection will get connected with this black white wire from here we are getting two outputs one is black green another one is black white so black green and another one is black white so so here we can take an output and we can connect it to the indicator for this one is for right and this one is for left again these two wires move through this wire sleeve and 
reaches W eight five joint. So here it get connected to this indicator. Likewise, this one also get connected to the indicator for the front side. Likewise, again this black green as well as black white move through the wire sleeve and reaches this white junction so here black green black white so here black green as well as black white so these lines reaches this tail rear part and which get connected to the rear indicator okay so here this one is for rear right and this one is for rear left and which will be connected to a common ground so here it's get connected to the indicator likewise here already we have seen ash color which is for connecting to the tail lamp here, here black green black white next we are going to see the connection for horn so this is what the connection for horn a red white wire so which is taken from this joint so it's red white which get directly connected to the horn from here we are having a violet color so this violet color reaches this black joint so this violet reaches this black joint from the black joint here it get connected to the horn switch so when we press this horn switch what happen this violet wire connection get grounded which get connected to the body therefore from the positive supply reaches horn from the horn by using this switch here it get connected to the ground therefore the circuit get closed and which triggers horn so again we are having violet that violet wire reaches horn switch and it get grounded then finally we will move on to the brake light the brake light can be enabled for both front as well as rear brake initially we will start with the front side this is what the connection for brake light so here we are having a red white so which is taken from this joint red white and which is connected to the brake lever from this brake lever it, it get connected to a green wire and which reaches a junction which is present 
over here likewise for rear brake so here we are having the connection which get connected to the rear brake switch so this one also this red white also taken from this red yellow joint red white which is connected to the brake switch and here we are getting the output as green wire that green wire get connected to the joint from this joint here this wire get connected to the white five joint so here we can see this this green wire reaches the rear end and which act as a brake light therefore if you apply front or rear brake you can see the change in the tail lamp brightness thanks for watching